Hey there everyone, JR with you again. Welcome back to my channel and the continuing ride through the backcountry of Oregon. made some poor life choices. Steep climb with loose rock. See if we can get back down in one piece. Situation report. Morning. Cold. Tried to start the bike. Battery was low. Cranked. Would not start. Hooked it up one more time after sitting in the sun and uh, it started. Got to think about what I'm going to do from here on. The decision is not to head out into the boonies any further. I'm going to head back north. I discovered the springs this morning full of tadpoles, but I got some water out of it anyway and I'm carrying that as an emergency. All this red cinders is uh, volcanic rock. Right out of camp here, I've turned on to the Transamerica Trail section. This is a cool black rock basalt lava. Very fun trail. Well, little chipmunk. I don't know if you made it or not, but you may have made some poor life choices. I don't know what coaster is. Starting to get up into uh, some mountainous area. Now we're topping out here at 6,398 feet. Turn back into more of a two track trail now. So far, today has been the most fun trail riding of the whole trip uh, in the last couple days. It's challenging, but it's not boulders and loose rock. Right here along the trail is a lava flow. And uh, yes, we're down at lower elevations now and it's getting hot. Amazing, huh? So how long do you think this chunk of lava right here has laid there until JR came along and not so easy. Where did this flow from? Let's uh, see if we can get back down in one piece. Make our own way on down to Sun River. Whew. See if I can get this thing turned around in this silt. <sighs> Yay! Oh, that cooling breeze feels good. Snow mountains again! about 10 miles out of Sun River now. I'm just gonna ride till I feel like stopping. It's pretty hot. Overall, not too bad. Here comes some ruts. See if I can ride on the edge without falling in. I'm just taking it slow. 
and easy but uh, as usual it gets towards evening you get more tired oh, here comes a bunch of silt oh that's cut pine smells so sweet I love it Well, I came down this route like an hour and a half ago and took the wrong turn. I'm going to backtrack into that outside of Bend and uh, try and get a place to camp for the night. Well, don't think I want to camp here. Well, good morning, folks. It's Wednesday, uh, July something or other. Road late into the evening last Back evening. Camped in a very crappy, dusty, noisy place with logging trucks going by all through the night. Crazy. Breakfast at IHOP, how can you beat that? My battery is nearly toast. New battery at Batteries Plus. I'm gonna change it out right here curbside. So I'm replacing this lithium battery with a lead acid battery because that's what's available readily right here. The lithium battery is four years old. It was a relatively inexpensive one. Let me know in the comments below your thoughts on lithium batteries, your experiences, maybe your favorite, whether you uh, prefer a lead acid battery. New battery installed. So after uh, bend and getting that new battery installed, I've hit the pavement. I'm going to see if I can get a um, first come, first serve campsite at Big Lake. View from my uh, campsite. Well, good morning people July 20 day 5 of my adventure out through Oregon in the back country slept well last night I needed a uh, rest after the rough day uh, I think I'm just gonna relax stay around camp beautiful spot and uh, maybe do some local rides hey, the proverbial fork in the road this is the way we want to go. Don't try to do any turns when you're in the sand. Look way out ahead. A little more speed than too slow, unless you're going to just flat out dog paddle. Another fork in the road, another bunch of deep sand. A little steep descent right here. Okay, let her ride, let her ride. Loose stuff, sand. DR just going right up it in second gear. Pick your line and stick to it. Get up off the seat on your pegs, let the bike right under you yeah I'm talking like I'm a pro or something not really just repeating what I've heard learned and put into practice Cash Mountain just to the uh, north northeast of me. Okay, break's over. Let's go.
I don't get too carried away. I don't need to be airborne. All right. Forest Service 550 up to Cache Mountain. How old is yours? This is 2015. This trip is just past 30,000 miles. Mine's a 2013, uh, a little over 21,000 miles. Did you come up the BDR from Sisters or? Yeah. Are you going to climb Cache Mountain? It's right up ahead of us. Okay. It gets steep and gnarly near the top. And I might try it this morning. I'm fresh out, just doing a local ride, and uh, I'll see how I feel. It's only about a half a mile ahead, I think. Okay. Well, I'm going to uh, go on up. What's your name? Mike. All right, Mike. Good, uh, good meeting and talking with you. Maybe I'll see you up on Cache Mountain. Okay. Going up Cache Mountain. Okay, I haven't gotten to the steep part yet. Loose sand, rocks, whoop de doos steep parts yet to come up. Here. Hello. Okay, the rock garden is giving us a reprieve and just handing out sand. Another little rock garden up and around downtown, up and around. More rock garden. Hello. Holy cow. Let her ride, baby. Woohoo! Okay, steep climb with loose rock. Oh, it's dancing around, up on the pegs. Okay, keep the momentum, keep the momentum. Getting a little steeper, stay in the groove. I think we're almost there. Oh yeah, another steep climb. Cinders, red cinders. This stuff will take you down to downtown. Sanders, I think I'd rather have sand than deep cinders. Hoo hoo.
Oh, we made it. Woo. <laughs> we made it. <laughs> uh, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Just hang. Yeah, don't stop. Man, I'd rather ride in the sand than those deep red cinders. Well, I think the view is worth it. So glad to have run into Michael just as I was approaching Cache Mountain. Wow. Gave me a chance to tackle that mountain without being solo. Gave both of us a chance to put Cache Mountain into the books. Well, the last of the dust as Michael disappears around the corner. Three sisters right there. Mount Washington. Well, I'm down off Cache Mountain, and uh, these guys attempted to go up it. See ya! And uh, turned around, dropped their bikes. We're going to head back up the trail to camp. Well guys, that does it for this video. Subscribe and uh, check out what I do in the future. Enjoyed having you along. Ride safe and I'll see you out there.